Traditionally, to create an animated video, you may need to know how to draw and paint, how to set up a character, and frame-by-frame -frame animation. So why don't you make things easier? Now you have a great way to animate with Crazy Talk Animator. Let us show you how. First, create an actor from a single photo. Just find a clean background and stand in the suggested pose. Then take a picture. Then remove the background from the photo and follow the simple fitting process. Done! Now your photo actor is ready for animation. But what if you need different styles? No problem! Simply turn any clothing catalog into a costume library. Search in magazines or other image sources and capture the clothing you want to recreate. Again, just import your photos into Crazy Talk Animator and save them in your virtual dressing room. Freely apply clothing templates to any actor. Even body parts can be interchanged and combined separately. You can try different styles and combinations to create infinite possibilities. Scale different body parts to enhance different looks. Once the casting is done, we may set up a stage with any type of media. You can capture furniture, textiles, household appliances, and save them in your stage library. You can even turn inanimate objects into lifelike animations like sketches, stuffed animals, or even food. Once your elements are ready, just drag and drop them into your stage. Crazy Talk Animator supports a wide variety of formats such as images, videos, and flash files. You may easily arrange image layers in the 3D view to create realistic depth sensations. Once your setup is ready, you may start to animate your characters. Simply select a puppet template with preset emotions and move your mouse to control your actor's facial expression. Additionally, you may use the same method to control body movements to walk, dance, act, and interact. Now that we have all the elements in place, it's time to roll the cameras and begin the storytelling. Explore amazing possibilities with the new Crazy Talk Animator.